what brought me here was the band. Definitely, I, that's what I wanted to do. That's why I came to the school. That's why I left my other high school. It was like the very first thing I thought of, just to audition as fast as possible and get in. Came out and did my audition, and I just, I was like, come on, I have to nail it. This is my shot. You know, it's got to be a good year. The band is just done a lot. It's kind of prestigious, hard to get into, and well, it, it takes a lot of work. Step by step, I got a brand new look. It's kind of a, a melding together of, of what I would call the three mainstream music programs. In a high school, right, you have a concert band, and you have a concert choir, and you, you have a jazz band. part is always the, the female singers, the girls, you know, the girls, because, I mean, they're very intelligent, they're talented, and they're competitive. You're pitted against other people, the, the more vocalists there are, the worse it is, and I don't think Mr. Emmy sees it that way. Then there's like nine girls that all want to sing one song, and only one of them's going to do it. One year, all these girls started showing up that had so much talent. I didn't handle it very well. Period. I mean, I just, you know, they were tearing each other apart. <laughs> Mr. MD is a little freaked out to feel like the raging hormones all the time and everything, so he's, he counts a lot on asking us for our opinions because he trusts us a lot. He counts a lot on us girls to tell him what to do in those situations because he really has no idea. <laughs> he really doesn't. Every day is so busy, and every day I do something that I'm gonna look back on in how many years and just be like, I can't believe that that was my grade 12 year.